Well, if you are not working today and looking for something fun to do on this Labor Day, we have something for the whole family. The Arizona Science Center is open for business and tomorrow is actually the last day of an interactive exhibit where you can explore nature's puzzles, patterns and mazes. Team 12's Trisha Hendricks brings us a closer look. It might be Labor Day. A lot of places closed today, but one place that is not the Arizona Science Center. And we are here taking an up close and personal look at this really cool mirror maze. Sari on Science, the chief curiosity officer here, is going to tell us more and show us around. Absolutely. So we, you nailed it. We are in a mirror maze, Numbers in Nature. It's all about finding nature's patterns, puzzles, and mazes. 1,800 square feet of geometrically arranged mirrors. It's just a really fun opportunity. Oh, I. I actually was going the wrong way there. Even I get lost and I've been through it like a hundred times. It can take a long time to go through here depending on how fast you go. A lot of people are afraid of math and they hear math and, and start to tune out. Uh, so this entire exhibition is a great way to have some fun. You start to see where uh, math shows up in nature, in architecture and in art and just all around us. So it looks like we've made it uninjured. We didn't run into any mirrors. We took it slow though. How long do you think that took? Uh, you know, a few minutes, but we made it. <laughs> we <laughs> made it. Next, we're going to head to an exhibit but one of my favorites has everything to do with proportions. This exhibit is all about the golden ratio, looking at the body's proportions. You're gonna step right up onto that blue circle there and it's gonna scan you. It uses a connect style technology. Reach up for those golden rings there and it's gonna continue to scan your body. So feet together, arms in a T. Now it says you're 6'3". Are you actually 6'3"? <laughs> with these heels, yes. So the reach of your arms is pretty much equal to your height. Here it's saying that your arm span is about 6'4", so your arms are a little longer than you are tall. What do you think about nice. that? Nice, I love that. Isn't that like Michael Phelps' height? Yes, yeah, so Michael Phelps is perfectly imperfect. You mentioned that before. Um, his arms are a little longer than he is tall, which makes him a much better swimmer. So there you have it, you guys. It looks like I have the golden ratio, which not a lot of people have, but slight differences make us all unique, right? Perfectly imperfect. What are your proportions? Six feet even. Six five on paper, though. I'm not sure what the wingspan is. I'm going to have to go check that out, see if I measure up. Well, for more information on the Arizona Science Center's Mirror Maze, just head over to our website, 12news.com.